everybody, I'm Lisa Roberry, your independent Scentsy consultant. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to jump into a box with the scent and warmer of the month for November. Now, if you have gotten the whiff box for this month, which is October 2019, then you have gotten a little sample of the scent of the month for November yourself. But as consultants, we are given the opportunity to purchase scent and warmer of the month kits that allow us to sniff through some things, have some bars on hand, on hand to make samples and to see the warmer of the month a little bit early to be able to share it with you a little bit early. So that is what we are unboxing today. So we've got our monthly specials flyers that comes in the kit. We have a room spray of the scent of the month, which is uh, snow kissed cranberry. And based on the sample that we got, it's a really good one. So, okay, we get nine bars of the scent of the month. Nine bars, which is really great. And then you get a party tester, which is a necessity in a business like this. So first, let's sniff through the scent. So the scent, the scent is called Snow Kissed Cranberry and I love it. I love that it's sweet and tart. I get a little bit of orange from this, and if I remember correctly, there's no orange in, in the scent description, but what I get, I get like an earthy green note. I also get the cranberry, the sweet tart cranberry, but I also get like an orange zest in there, and it is a cooler fragrance. So, it's almost like cranberry garland, but with a little bit of like orange zest to it. For me personally, that's what I get. We know my sniffer does its own thing, but oh, it smells so good. I really love this. Let's uh, rip into one of these flyers so that I can tell you what Sensi says about it. So, snow kissed cranberry, frozen pink, cran frozen pink cranberries <laughs> trek through a path of fresh fallen powder among white balsam and glistening sugared woods. So there you go. So there is definitely that balsam note in there. Oh, it smells so good. I love this. The sweet tart cranberries. And then I get a random rogue orange zest note, but I really, really love this. I love this so much. I actually haven't even had a chance to warm the sample of it yet. So um, I think that'll be on my to-do list maybe in the next day or so because this just, oh man. Oh, it smells so good. I love that. That is probably one of my favorite scents of the month in a long time. So that is fantastic. Okay, shall we get into the warmer? Because this warmer, it looks like it's gonna be adorable. So it's a little bit of a longer box. So if you have the happy camper warmer or the world was it world traveler warmer road less road less traveled that's what it was world traveler was the scent road less traveled was the warmer um then you're gonna need this for your collection it is called christmas camper and if you are a traveler yourself if you've got an rv then i feel like this is a necessity for you to have in your warmer collection Let's get in here. Let me tell you what Scentsy says and then we'll unbox it together. So warmer of the month is Christmas Camper. It is a 25 watt warmer, six and a half inches tall. And Scentsy says reminiscent, reminiscent, I cannot talk today, of a simpler time. Our retro Christmas Camper warmer looks right at home on the mantle or credenza. Festive yet down to earth, the hand-painted red and galvanized steel warmer features classic holiday decorations and a playful rooftop wax dish, making a make, making it a cheerful addition to uh, all the merriment. How cute is this? I can't wait to rip into this because it's so cute. Okay, and as always, we've got little quotes on the inside here we have our mission statement and then we also have a quote from from orville and it says be a star big enough that others can wish upon you love that and we have our warnings don't cut yourself mm-hmm mm-hmm <laughs> this is so cute okay 
All right. A nice, big, deep dish here. Oh, they did so good with this. Honestly, I haven't even seen any other videos or anything from other consultants who have gotten their warmers. Um, but when I first saw this, just quick glance, I thought it might be another ceramic warmer. And then obviously I took a closer look and saw that it is, there is some metal pieces to it. But I, oh my gosh, you guys, how cute is this? And I love that it's got like a screw here and it's the galvanized metal. It's, it's really, really cute. I love all of the detail on here. We have the holiday lights. We have the Christmas wreath your warmer sits right on top here so let me get into oh my gosh this is so cute oh so cute and as i mentioned before it is a 25 watt warmer which means you can use <clears throat> any of our colored bulbs in this so how fun would this be with a green bulb or with a red bulb i feel like that would be super cute do I have either of those? No. I've got the red bulb downstairs. I think I have the green one downstairs too. Yep, I sure do. So we'll check it out with the clear bulb. The clear bulb is what comes with your warmer. So, and then we have a nice deep square clear dish. There's a little four on the bottom there. That's just letting you know, do not use more than four cubes in your warmer dish. These are cubes. Each bar is separated into eight cubes. I honestly just use two cubes for each of my warmers. I think two is plenty, but I do know that some people tend to use three and sometimes four. Just don't use more than four as it is recommended on here because you it will overflow. The wax does not, uh, it, it doesn't burn off because we're not burning the wax. So when you're warming it, the, the wax levels don't change. So that's another little tip. Make sure that you're not just adding wax to your dish, that you're actually cleaning out the wax when you are refreshing it. That got on a little bit of a different tangent here. Okay, <laughs> let's see. Get my cord unraveled here. This is so cute. I love this. And it seems like the cord's a little bit longer than normal, which is nice. <clears throat> Oh my gosh, how cute is this? Oh, I can't. Okay. So, <laughs> so we have, and you can see there's all kinds of windows here that is going to make this glow. So obviously the metal part is not going to glow, but oh my gosh, <laughs> you've got your little door here with the Christmas wreath there. You have the Christmas wreath on the, on the front side of it. This is so cute. I love this. So the, like I mentioned, the metal doesn't glow. It's, it's opaque, but you are going to get the glow from all the windows. There's windows in the back, windows in the front. There's these little slits on either side that are going to allow the light to shine through. And then you have your dish, which is clear, and that's going to shine through as well. How sweet is this? I love that. That's so cute. So if you know someone who has an RV, they love their RV, they love to travel, or you just feel like this is totally someone's style, then this is going to be super cute. Now this is going to be available starting November 1st for 10% off, which is $45. If this is available after November, and into December, then it will bump back up to $50. So same thing goes for the scent of the month. The scent of the month will be marked down 10%. So the bar will be $5.40. The room spray will be $7.20. The scent circle will be $2.70. So those are all US pricing. If you want to be on my pre-order list, definitely let me know. As always, I will leave my contact information down below, my email, all of that jazz will be in there. So if you have any questions or want to be on my pre-order list, definitely let me know because this is only available while supplies last. That goes for the warmer, that goes for the scent, any of these special items are limited time only. So if you want to be on a pre-order list of mine, just let me know. So once again, available November 1st for $45. So super, super sweet. Love that. 
So that is it. That is the scent and warmer of the month for November. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new, please subscribe. Otherwise, I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.